Hey guys, so I'm back to another quick form video. Today's video, I finally got it for you guys. This is the LG Style 5 on Boost Mobile, guys. So here it is in all its glory, as you can see. I finally got it today. I actually express shipped it for you guys so I can, you know, do this unboxing and check it out for you guys. So everybody knows that the quick variant came out. Um, and then, of course, I believe July 1st is when Boost Mobile actually got this one. And I, like I said, I express shipped it for you guys. So I can get it, but here it is in the studio finally, the LG Style 5. So you guys already know how it goes. We'll look at the box first, unbox it, and then we'll look into the phone a second. So let's get into it. So as you can see, here it is, guys. Boost Mobile, as you can see, I believe it did change the design on the top here. It looks a little bit different, but nice. Boost Mobile Unlimited Data Talking Text. And then let's get into the specs. But before we get into the specs, guys, let's look at this design of uh, the phone here at least on the picture, very colorful. And of course it is showing the pen right there, but very, very colorful at that. So pretty, pretty cool. And then of course it has a July 19th date right there. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. It says Friday, July 19th. So I don't know some people are saying it might be the Stylo 5 Plus variant, who knows, but we'll see what's up on that date. So let's get into the specs guys. So as you can see, LG Stylo 5. This is rocking a 6.2 inch full HD plus 1080p display. So yes, no more 720 guys. We're finally getting a 1080p display on the stylo um, to start off. No more 720. So that's pretty cool. 32 gigs of internal storage or 32 gigs of ROM, three gigs of RAM. Yes, guys, finally, finally three gigs of RAM, no more two gigs. So shout outs to LG for doing that on the LG Stylo 5. Definitely a bump up from two gigs. Um, and of course, uh, thank God we have 32 gigs of internal storage and not 16. Then of course, it looks like we have a 13 megapixel main camera or a rear camera with a wide five megapixel front facing or selfie camera. So I do wish that the front was at least an eight or even a 13, that way it would be a 13, 13. But of course the one, the camera that matters the most is the back one. But like I said, five megapixels for a selfie, we'll have to see how that looks. So, this is rocking a 1.8 gigahertz octa-core processor. It is a Snapdragon 450, guys. So that's another thing, like I said, um, I was hoping we got the 6 series at least, like a 670 or something, but no, it's the four, 450. So same thing as last year's model, so uh, at least Snapdragon. But let's uh, finish looking at it and then let's go ahead and open it. And so as you can see, not on the left side, you just have the Boost Mobile logo. And then on the right, just some terms, conditions, and all this other stuff, trademarks. In the back is where we'll see more info. So let's get into it, guys. So you can see LG Style 5. This is a 6.2 inch full HD plus uh, HD plus display, a 1080p display with stylus. So the battery is pretty big, guys. It's a 3,500 milliamp battery. So definitely a little bump up. Talk time up to 21 hours. So definitely that big battery is going to help. Um, 13 megapixel main camera with a 5 megapixel uh, selfie camera. Fingerprint sensor. So yes, guys, it does have a fingerprint sensor. I like that they show it there. And same thing, 32 gigs of internal storage with 3 gigs of RAM. Android OS, which I'm guessing it's, of course, Pi. And it is, this is 4G LTE with 2 times 20 carrier aggregation and HPUE. So definitely, definitely worth it. So... Um, at least with that. So now let's get into it guys. You guys already know how it's a hassle to open these boxes. I mean, look at this. It's like crazy glued on there. So let me go ahead and skip it to that part. All right, guys. So on this one, I actually did a better job on it. As you can see, <laughs> very cool. Didn't even destroy it. So let's get into it and let's see how it looks. So, whoa, look at this. Very nice. Check this out. Wow, so there it is guys, the LG Style 5. So big, big Style 5 logo right there, very nice. So same thing, let's look at this box real quick. So 6.2 inch full HD plus display with stylus, 1.8 gigahertz optical processor, same thing, 32 gigs of RAM, um, or three gigs of RAM, my bad, and 32 gigabytes of a ROM, 13 megapixel rear camera with a five megapixel uh, selfie camera. So. Same thing as the box. Um, let's just finish looking at this before we open it. So on the left side, it just says Stylo 5, LG Stylo 5. And on the back, let's look at it since it will have a little bit of different specs. So very nice. Like I said, the main features on this is a 6.2 inch full HD display. So very nice. 
1.8 gigahertz octa-core processor. I wish it said uh, that Snapdragon, but like I said, on BoostMobile.com, it does say it's a 450. Uh, of course, three gigs of RAM with 32 gigabytes of ROM or inter on internal storage and a 13 megapixel rear-facing camera, five megapixel front-facing camera. And then of course, it tells you this. This is actually for hearing aid, guys, if you don't know what that is, so T T3 and M4. I don't know that, I just kind of figured that out the other day, so pretty cool. Um, and you can see it is rocking a Snapdragon as well, just so you can see it. So let's go ahead and open it. Let me go ahead and get my handy dandy uh, knife here, little pocket knife, and open it up. So the box is kind of plain, guys. It is just a plain gray box. So nothing to really cheer about. You know, I, I like other phone boxes. They, they're more colorful. This one's just kind of plain, but let's get into it. Whoa, this is my first time actually looking at the LG Stylo 5, guys. Just looking at it, this thing's a huge phone. Good God. I mean, 6.2 inches, it's pretty big, but dang. All right, so here we go. Let's look what we get inside. So, of course, you do have your charger, and it is a Type-C, as you can see there, guys. It is a type C, very nice. And then of course you do have your LG wall adapter there as well. So very cool. And then let me see if it'll focus, uh, probably too small, but you get it. So you do get your chargers in here. And that's about it. It doesn't look like there's a manual. So let's go ahead and get the phone out. Whoa. Oh, and there's the manual here. So let's finish this off by just looking at it. And sometimes they're like, it, does the phone come with a case? It doesn't look like it. So here you do have your SIM extractor tool. It's just typical LG. So pretty cool. And then of course you do have your little manual here as well, guys, for all of you that might need. Um, well, this is actually not even the manual. They don't even give you a manual. This is just the safety information. So no manual. So let's put this aside. And let's actually get into the phone. So let's look at the phone, guys. Very, very nice. I like it. It's, it feels like a big phone, especially on my hands. Good Lord. So you do have your five megapixel front facing camera right there, guys. You do have your earpiece right there. I do like that. It comes with a plastic protector on there. On the right side, you do have your power button right here. On the left side, you do have your volume up and volume down. On the bottom, you do have your 3.5mm uh, headphone jack right there. If you can see right there, if it'll focus it. Oh, there we go. So 3.5mm headphone jack, my, your Type-C uh, connector right here will go. So that's your charging port. You do have uh, bottom firing speakers. It looks like three little holes. And then, of course, you do have the pen right there. So very nice. I like this look. It looks very, very nice. So then, of course, um, in the... On the top, you don't have anything, but on the back, here we go, guys. I like this color. It's actually more of a, just a solid color. So I like it very, very much. Uh, let me take this off for you guys. All right, that way you can see it a little bit better. So it is more of a creamy color, guys. In the picture it shows, there's like a two-tone, like a darker gray on the bottom and a lighter gray on the top. But my variant looks like it's just a very white looking gray super light gray but overall it looks nice of course it's plastic it's not glass or anything like that so you're not going to get any wireless charging or anything like that you do have your lg logo on the bottom and then your fingerprint sensor on the back and then your 13 megapixel rear facing camera as well but overall it feels good guys in your hand so it is a little bit chunky at least what it feels like and then also you got your sim um, tray right here but i don't know if you can see it it is a little bit Kind of on the chubbier side, but it's pretty cool. So let's go ahead and turn on. So here we go, the LG Stylo 5. All right, guys. So after about 10, 15 minutes of waiting for this to start, um, we finally got there, you know, just trying to activate. And like I said, I didn't put a service on it just yet since I unboxed it. So it always takes a little bit. But here it is, guys. Check it out, of course. LG um, a skin over it. So the, 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 the usual, you know, it's pretty cool. So here it is, very, very nice, and check that out. So if we scroll this down, you're gonna to get to your notification bar, um, and then I as well, quick 
shortcuts, but as you can see, here it is. It's telling you don't pull the battery out, so I do like that. So a lot of people will try to put, you know, a knife through this thing and get the battery out for some reason. So trust me, I've seen it. So if you scroll this down, here you go. As you can see, it says capture, Wi-Fi, sound, Bluetooth, rotation, DTS, um, 3D surround, airplane mode, flashlight. So flashlight, I would say it's, it's decent. Sync, data, battery, saver, extender, location. Then on one more side, it will have comf comfort view, do not disturb, and data saver. So pretty cool. Let's go into the settings here and let's see what we get. So here's the settings, guys. Of course, airplane mode and all this nice stuff. Tethering, calling, file sharing, of course. Media saver, um, LG Air Drive, mobile data, VPN. Sounds will, of course, like I said, typical LG. If you ever use an LG, this is the same options that you'd get. You get ringtone ID, a ring with vibrate, a flash alert for incoming calls, notifications, sound quality and effects. So this is, like I said, for that surround sound and, of course, equalizer and all that stuff and what are different tones so pretty cool let's go into general though and see um, how much storage we actually get so let's see like i said i haven't installed anything but wow look at that already used half 49 percent guys so 15.67 gigs in use wow so you're you're getting about 16.33 gigabytes free out of that 30 so wow, the system alone is taking 15, that's crazy, 15 gigabytes is already using, so half of your storage, poof, away. So this is basically like you're getting a 16 gigabyte phone and you're really getting almost 16 gigabytes. So as you can see, it's already using 49, God, what a waste. But hey, I guess the software has to go on there. Uh, of course it does have knock knock, that's pretty cool. If you guys know LGs, they love that knock knock stuff. But overall, the screen looks beautiful. It is a 1080p display, guys. So not bad at all. Let's go to about phone and see what version it's running and all that stuff. Software. Uh, cool. So yep, as you can see, it is Android version 9. One last thing before we finish this off, let's go ahead and see how the cameras look. Uh, so. Uh, does have HDR. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it does say HDR. But overall, it looks it looks nice. I mean, the camera's not bad at all. Does have AI camera as well, so very very nice. And let's look at other settings here. So HDR auto steady sh recording. Wow, reduce motion while. Re Whoa, what is that? Look at that. Let's see. Steady recording guys reduces motion blur in videos. Pretty cool, wow. So cool features. You, of course you do have your full vision down here um, and all that good stuff. Timer, the quality, some modes, some different modes here. So this is for food, panorama, flash, jump out, YouTube live, wow. I'm gonna have to try to live stream on this. And of course your different effects. Uh, stickers, I believe it is. So pretty cool, let's look at the AI camera. So pretty, pretty cool. And there we go, so let's see. Oh, uh, it looks kind of grainy, you guys. I'm looking at the front-facing camera. Even here with good lighting, uh, the front-facing camera is pretty, how should I say, blurry. <laughs> A lot of noise, so unless you're outside, it's probably not gonna look that good, so yeah. but. Overall, that is it, guys. That's some unboxing and first boot up and kind of some quick specs on it. Let me know what you think. Let me show you the pen before I actually finish this off. And like I said, I will be doing other tests later on. Now, one cool thing about the pen before I finish this off, and I'll put this in a review, is remember how the other one you put your fingernail on the left side? This one you actually put it on the right side. It's still a little hassle to take out, but check this out. So here's the pen, guys. Very, very nice. And then here's the tip. I don't know if it'll focus it or not, but overall, pretty, pretty cool. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Let me know what you think. If you want to support the channel so I can bring more phones like the LG Stylo 5 and other phones, please do donate to my PayPal in the description below or check out my number one supporter, netbuddy.co. They offer true and limited AT&T hotspot, never throttle or capture for only 
$65 a month, but if you use my link and promo code at checkout, you will save $5. That promo code is Sanchez45973. Thank you guys. Let me know in the comments what you think. Comment, rate, subscribe, share, and uh, let me know what you think about the LG Stylo 5. So, yep.